Hello and welcome to Retro Bikes Dublin. Today we're looking at a replica Honda uh, Z50 monkey bike. It's actually got a 125cc four speed engine in it. It's only done a thousand miles since the new engine put, has put into it. It's done about 200 miles, so very small mileage on the little bike. Great fun, great for the Honda 50 runs, el eligible for all of them, and a bit less than the, uh, the real McCoy. So front tire then, it's also road registered. It's currently uh, English registered, but we're in the process of getting it registered here in Ireland. Front tire then is perfect. Front mud guard, as little as it is, is all there and in really nice condition. Front forks are really good condition either side. Front headlamp and indicators are there in, in nice condition as well. Dometer then is all good condition. Handlebars as well, the classic fold down ones. Indicators on the right hand side, good condition. The tank on the right hand side is perfect. Same up over the top and onto the instrument clusters, lights and electric start on this model as well. Uh, indicators and so on. On the left hand side of the horn, got a new exhaust on it with the Simmotos engine on it. 125cc. The exhaust itself which has minor scuffing but I think that's just more uh, blemishes and just will come up with a polish. No real scrapes in it. Seat is in perfect condition with the Honda Monkey on the back. Number plate, indicator, lenses, rear, rear mud guard I should say. Rear tire is perfect, rear drum is good. Shocks on the rear upgraded in really nice condition. Chain is in good condition. Left hand side uh, aftermarket air filter and bigger air fil filter for the bigger engine. Carburetor as well. Uh, engine area really good. Sorry, that's from uh, my mucky feet. We did clean the bike though. Uh, as it is see, left hand side of the tank then all very good. Up and over has two keys with it as well. As you can see, over the top then as well have the original mirrors on it too. So a really, really nice Z50 replica in very good condition with a 125cc engine. Now I move from the visual analysis onto the ride along video. Okay, so we're onto the little monkey. Um, I'll show you how to start it now in a sec. It's very easy, just kick, kick and go. Uh, only really unusual thing about this, instead of down all the way up, it's just all the gears are up. So uh, 125cc or 150 or whatever it is, large engine in it, so beware, beware at the start. Even I might even take off here, but it will do wheelie if you're not very gentle at the throttle like that. And away we go. Let's have some fun, eh? So a brilliant little bike for going on those nifty 50 runs. Everyone's going to be looking at you. I actually, for once, adjusted my mirrors before I came out. So I have proper mirrors, which I can see at the back of. I'm usually a bit of a useless sod and don't bother with the correcting the mirrors. But here we are. Up through the gears and there's plenty of speed in it as in you know these are usually coming with 50 cc engines and the bike is on the book is a 50 cc so if you do only have a 50 cc license then take your risk as you like so up the hill here plenty of power i mean this thing's well capable of uh, 80 kilometers 90 kilometers an hour with the larger engine okay this is extremely hard to see with this low sun here at least we got some sun today, it's the first time in about a week and a half. Maybe we've actually had some sun rather than just overcast and rain. Here we go, into first gear. And nice turning circle, as, as you would expect from a small bike. Super, super fun, great little thing if you have a short journey in and out of town or something for work. Or just basic commuting in general. It could 100% be used as that. It's got the nice aftermarket exhaust, so it makes a bit of noise and a nice noise at that. So people will hear you coming. And into second gear. And you can auto uh, or blip the throttle to go down in gears. If you are used to um, seesaw gears on Honda 90s and 50s, you should know how to do that. Kind of, it's halfway in between just putting down the, the throttle. It does uh, go into neutral. So, or not the throttle, but the gear stick itself. And we're turning left here. Our left indicator is working, thank God. As you can see there, auto blip, or not auto blip, but manual blip to go down into the gears. I will give this learner driver plenty of room. I'm gonna turn into the left here and I'll put her down on the side stand and show you what she's like. Hopefully she'll tick over for you guys after a bit of a run. And there we go, into neutral. I have to just remember that it is all down to go into neutral rather than anything else. There we are. There's the uh, low beam and high beam. Turn them off, left indicator, 
front and rear working, right indicator, rear and front working, uh, ticking over nicely. It's a thousand bike. It's only, as I said, I think in the visual analysis, it only has about 150 miles, I'd say, on the new engine that's in it. And uh, before that, it only had about a thousand miles anyway. We're just over that. I have to get quite close to this bike to get it into the picture for the thumbnail. But that's been it. That's the Honda uh, replica Z50 uh, monkey bike really really nice bike i mean it's going for in around half the price of what a an original one will go for so if you are looking in for a monkey but just don't quite see the warranting of uh spending upwards of three and a half grand on one then uh this is the one for you um what else is there that's really it brake lights everything working it's all ready to go uh small mileage so pretty much brand new new engine tires are perfect uh upgraded rear shocks stuff like that but that's been it for this video if you have liked it please do leave a like also a comment down below what you think of this uh, replica Z50 and also subscribe we're nearly at 3,000 subscribers so if you could get us uh, to the 3,000 that would be greatly appreciated as well if you are looking to purchase or have a look what the price of this bike is there's it in the description below for the done deal page if it's not in, on that URL if you go into it and it's uh, the bike isn't there it's usually because it is sold and if you do want to reach out to us about any questions on any of our bikes uh, we are at email as well but all of our socials are at Retro Bikes Dublin for Instagram and facebook as well as our official website at www.retrobikesdublin.com so that's been it for this video thank you for watching